Hi guys. I, I really had a great weekend and I hope you really had two uh, great weekend. I spent a lot of time with my family outdoors and had a lot of sun. Some I got a little bit sunburned, but I don't think you see it on the video at all. Um, yeah, so I really enjoyed my weekend. I prepared two videos, which I now have to to uh, to do some cutting and editing on them, which I want to do here at my workplace, not at home. And so I'm, I have to do this now or tomorrow. And I, I really want to some video, some vlog, some something on the weekend. I wanted to share a little bit and was really excited. So. And I, I thought, oh, I have to say this and this, and it's just like always, so now I'm here, and I don't remember that much. I said I went a lot outdoors and spent a lot, lot of, a lot of time with my baby and my wife, and it was a, a blast. It was really fun, and I came to my workplace, and first thing I saw, uh, someone stole my bicycle seat. So. So the life life gives on the one hand and on the other it just <laughs> it just takes. And so I was a bit down yesterday at night and I thought, ah, somebody tr uh, really tried to to destroy my weekend, but he failed. And and so today I I went to work and I saw in the, inter in the internet of my workplace, ah, they have uh, an event for running and ah, they make a um, a free um, a free measurement for for the basal metabolic rate uh, in the rec calorimetry. So, and this thing, I think this normally in a studio costs about 50 euros too. So, they stole my bicycle seat and today I got it back. So, um, in one way, and, uh, one of the videos I, I prepared is about this topic about um, basal metabolic rate. So, I'm really excited about this possibility because. I thought uh, I maybe will do it if I get stuck somewhere, if I get to to plateau and there's no way change for a longer time, and maybe we'll do this. But um, now I can do it for free, and I will surely report how it went. And maybe I have to rethink my whole video series. I, I, I have to ca calculate my basal metabolic rate and show and see if it's different from what the machine says afterwards. And I. Uh, I'm really excited about this possibility to 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 see. But I think the the for most people, what you calculate is 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 um, it's not that wrong. But um, I I'm really excited to see if it really is is pro is proximate or if there's a, a whole diff a, a big difference between the the calculation and the the, re the real world. Okay. The uh, indirect calorimetry they do in the studio is not not the same thing they do in the clinic. It's maybe not that precise, but I don't for for I think for a single person and for for the home use it makes not that much of a difference. So I'm excited about this and this will be in third June. And yeah, this was this and yeah I went. I kind of of bailed on my workout today. To went to I went to the police, but I used my mountain bike, so I did about 22 kilometers on, on my mountain bike. So I had also a workout, but I, I wanted to do some strength training today. But I thought if I, if I if I go to training, go to the police, and I have to go to the bicycle store, which is closed when I go back from training, so I had to go to. To the bicycle store, to the police, and now I'm here and making my vlog. And afterwards, I just need to hit the shower really bad. Um, yeah, so bicycle needs to be fixed. This will be about 55 to 60 dollars uh, or euros, and it's not 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 good. But who shares? Uh, it's just money. Uh, not that I have that much money, but it's uh, just. Why should I be upset about it? Yes, I'm, I'm angry at the guy because some guy stole a thing from me, but he had maybe that got stolen her bicycle and this would be much worse. So. And maybe police get them, but I think that the the clearance curve or on bicycle theft of every all kinds is below one percent. So 
I'm not not I don't don't have any hopes. I just went to want to went to the police for okay, um, because they already stole some things from my, my bicycle and I I really think uh, maybe if they do this all the time they may put a camera over there or police looks a bit all, more often on the place or so. Yeah, who knows? Yeah. So I think this is enough excitement for the day. Um weight loss is is uh, I think it's a bit kind of a plateau at the moment. I lost already lost some weight and I think I'm I'm losing body fat so this is quite a great thing. I want to do an update on the on the weekend and then I want to, to make a resume for, for my and then I will, will do every all two weeks and every always do um, if, um, a resume of the of the month how the month went and I think this month they now went really great. And last week I trained six days as I had planned. I also managed one workout in the morning and I'm what I want to try this week is, is to, to move almost all my workouts in the morning. I have um because uh, it said it's to be more efficient and my problem is if I kind of, I really enjoy biking. I have one of my favorite things in the world, but the problem is if I go for a long bike ride after work, I arrive at home at eight o'clock or later and I cannot sleep at night. It's, um, I'm so, so pushed from all the adrenaline and my, my metabolism is working. And, this makes makes it really hard for me to get some sleep and to lose weight. You also need some decent sleep, and so this is not the best thing there. And so I want to try to move my workouts in the morning before work, which is really hard for me to to get up that early. And at the moment I, I can do jogging, but I think for for strength workout I'm lacking a bit of time. It will be better when my colleague gets back from when when her hand is, is all healed. Uh, but this will take about two or three weeks more. So I have to do how it works best at the moment. And this means I will do try to have three three cardio workers out in the morning. I will I will try all um, interval training this week and I tried it last week on Friday and yeah it was uh, it was really challenging for challenging for me because I I I can run very long, but I cannot run very fast. So this was I mean, maybe this will help me get some speed in, in walking, and maybe I can can do a marathon next year or in the end of year. I think next year is more realistic. But um, I, I I don't like the the the, the endurance. I don't like, but the the speed is just my speed is just horrible at at running and. So this is maybe maybe this will improve with some more interval training. Uh, I'm sure I, keep, I will keep you updated on the training if it's if it's great if it's good. Um, so yeah, thank you thank you for watching and I really hope you had a, a as good or a better weekend than me because yeah, it's just so much so good to feel good and be happy. I, I had an idea for, for a series of motivation videos and maybe we'll do in the next weeks, but I have a lot of ideas at the moment and to write them down and see what I can realize. But yeah, it's, I really enjoy still enjoying the YouTubing thing and yeah, have to put put a little bit more time in it because on this weekend I had no time for YouTube at all, but my wife was really happy so this was not also not not only a bad thing. So thank you very much for watching again and bye bye. See you next day, maybe tomorrow, maybe Wednesday. Yeah, as I think tomorrow I will, will finish my videos and hope to hope probably the internet here will manage to load them up and I already said two times bye and I'm still talking so bye bye guys. Thanks you for thank you for watching. Bye. Mm -hmm.